Hello, welcome back. Last time I did Five Pointed Spear, which was a real good time. It was very cool. Uh, something occurred to me um, when I was looking for secrets here. I haven't actually gone back to previous entries and checked to see if I'd missed any secrets. Turns out there was actually one here in Sirius Seepage. This should not take too long. I guess I'm going to have to blur that out again because I'm not hold showing the name of that hold. I guess I should start draw it every time. Ah, I wish there were a way I could opt out of beta notifications up here, but I don't know a way to do that. It's fine. All right, so brain seep. Uh, looks like I'm gonna have to do this, and then they come to me, and then I need to wait a moment, and then I'm in danger here if I step too close to that wall. Okay, well, I can pretty much just do this. Not quite, but pretty much. And then some of this. This should be completely safe. Okay. Oh, okay. So I have to keep one alive. Night. That's fine. I can do that. Just like... not like this. Okay, so this is where the actual puzzle is here. I think what I want to do is this. There we go. Okay, done. That was the secret room. Hold master, it's nice. So that confirms to me, hold mastered comes up before all required rooms are done. I always have questions about this, that because I can never really understand. <laughs> anyway, Master of the Mundane, first place, that's what I'm doing today. By Laylight, Chaco. One day, Beether was taking a walk in the park when suddenly he realized he was actually inside a dungeon that was also in the park somehow. Easy, this'll be like a walk in the park. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Return. Complete. So somebody pointed out to me that this, the thing that looked like this over in, um, in Mo Butterfly's uh, Five Pointed Spear entry uh, is what the brain rating looks like on Caravel Net. So this is this is the, the meter of five brains and unknown amount of fun. Only a master of general technique shall pass. Okay. So this is a an unrequired room, but it does have things to kill. Right. Okay. General technique. Only a master of the obvious shall pass. Oh boy. Okay. So. Is this eight gates of bill? Kind of. Oh, dear. Okay, so the usual way to do this is to do the one that closes stuff first. Okay, yeah, I understand. Master of the obvious. Yeah, so do the one that closes the most doors, then the one that closes one fewer than that, then the one that doesn't close any doors is usually the way to think about these. Uh, yeah, nothing more advanced should be required. So bottom, top, middle. Master of the obvious. Was this... Bottom, top, middle. Okay. Only a master of deduction shall pass. Okay, so less obvious. So each of these is only opened by one thing, huh? Okay, so I understand how this works. Uh, since this is a bit tighter, I can... Um, okay, so my sword. Sword's gonna be kinda in the way here. Alright, so here's the thing. Um, okay, this is interesting. I need to hit this one after I've hit that which means doing this. Then, okay, I can I can manage my sword properly. Then I do this, and then I do this again. And then I this, and then I think this again? No. This, and then this, there we go. Okay. But then this, and whatever opens that, you. And then you... Okay. This is an orb puzzle that I'm okay with. I usually don't like these, just generally speaking. Okay, so I feel like I want to start there. And then do this and this. And then whatever opens that. That one down there. Done. Yay. Okay. Cool. I won the orb puzzle. 
Wraithwing. Scroll. Serpents. Only a master of Wraithwing movement shall pass. Uh, I don't think this requires me to be a master of Wraithwing movement. Maybe there's something more to it that I don't immediately see. Uh, oh, okay, there is actually. So that is slightly more complicated than it looks at first. I can pull instead of pushing. And then get around and then push like this, maybe? That'll get you kind of up there, but not really. Okay. There is some nuance here. Hmm. There is definitely some nuance here. Okay. Well, I mean, you're there. I might as well do this while I have a ch chance. But those are the easy ones. These are the less easy ones. I can't step here at all. And now I'm back in this situation. Am I not a master of wraithwing movement? I thought I was, but maybe I'm wrong. Let's do... well, no, I don't get a choice. Uh, well, that's different. Now that I have this, I think I'm okay, because you can go there, and then I can encourage you to be over here and do this. Okay. Now, uh, I guess I can do this. That didn't help me. I guess I can do this again. So I haven't burned my bridge that I used for this yet. Actually, I'd rather, instead of that, maybe do... Uh, no, I don't get a choice. Okay. This is non-trivial. It's not very hard, but it's not trivial either. There is some challenge to this. There, I did it. Okay, I did it. Cool. Nice! That was actually pretty cool. I expected it would be trivial, and I was wrong. And I'm happy to be wrong. Golems, are you standing in fire traps? No, that's shallow water. Only a master of... Positioning shall pass. Okay. So most optimal place to start, uh, I can't tell yet, but this does let me access the platform without moving anybody. It seems sensible that I would want to do this. But I'm not certain yet. I can avoid that. I can do this, certainly. Okay, this is fascinating. Um... I think I'm going to want to do probably th maybe even this. That'll give me the most distance for getting to that shallow water. Okay, now... Um, this here, I think I understand what I have to do with it. Let's go up this way. Pull them all... Ouch! Pull them all up here. I can do this, and it's fine. I can pull them further, and then I think maybe with this distance I can get there in time. I can, and do this. Good. Okay. So that's one column solved. Now for you... Yeah, you're a problem. Why did I kill this? That was a dumb idea. I shouldn't have done that. I'm not a master of positioning yet. Okay. So what did I do? I did this. Just leave him alone, pull down here, do this. Well, do uh, this first. Do that, and then I can get at it from both ends. Okay. So that's fully resolved. Uh, let's do this, certainly. I'd be silly not to. Now, 
Okay, that gets me there, and then I can do that from both ends. Good. Okay. So you, it's pretty obvious I'm going to do this. And I don't need anything special for that one down there. I can just kind of do it. Now from here, okay, this one looks easier than the others. Um, yes. Okay. I want fewer golems here. Uh, doesn't matter about that. Move order might. Yeah, so that it has to be from the other other way. Because they unspool from... Well, no, that doesn't make a difference, does it? It felt like it did, but I think I... Looking back on it, it doesn't make sense. Because I don't care where the back ones are, it's just the front one. Hold on, what did I, what did I do incorrectly that I felt like I couldn't do that from the north. I don't know. I can do it from the north. I just was thinking about something wrong in the moment. Okay, cool. 11th place. Not that it matters, but that's the place I got. Only a master of observation shall pass. I see the walls. Ah, so here's the problem. This rattlesnake, since they like east and north, this rattlesnake's gonna go straight to me. So right, my observation is that what I wanna do is put a mud baby here before I uh, go up there. I'm a master of observation. Um, how do I make a mud baby? There isn't a place right here. I need to f I need to make a mud baby and I don't immediately see a place to do that. This looks promising. Here we go. I made one. There we go. <laughs> that was silly. Yeah, so no matter what the rattlesnake's preferences were, it would have come straight for me if I had allowed it to um uh, um, to move freely. Okay, great. Hi, Mimics. Only a Master of Ratchets shall pass. Oh, cool. Okay. <laughs> uh, what the heck? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. This is silly. This feels super wrong. Yeah, I, c I need to. I need to go there myself. This is not for mimics. This is for Bethro. So you just sit there. Hey. Hey. I think I can rearrange the mimics into a friendly formation after I've done this. Now, this is where things are going to get real interesting. Meh. Okay, that seems good. Um, let's do some of this. Ratchet in that direction. Oh, uh, that's fine. Oh, okay, that's still fine. This isn't particularly, but maybe I can just, like... This is fascinating. This looks bad, but I'm not convinced that it is bad. I'm doing this a really, really messy way. Feels like I want to leave you out here. And I'd like to get that other dude involved. And I'd like to move you down here before that happens. Okay, so then let, let's me traverse to here. 
So now with those guys, if I had positioned them better, I think I can kill this Mimic at this point. And I think it's going to make my job easier. No, no, now that I look at it, I think he needs to maybe come with me. Okay, so I have a problem then. I did not ratchet correctly. I can fix it. Um, I can fix it. Uh, why don't you not do that, please? Am I ready to hit this? Yeah, sure. Might as well. Yeah. Okay, so that could be good, maybe, if I would do, like, maybe this, maybe? Hey, there we go. Okay, now I can kill the mimics. No longer needed. I thought there was going to be a second step of that where I'd have to do this and then redo the ratchet process. But then I found out that I could open all the all the doors all at once and everything's cool. Great! I guess one of these pressure plates that I didn't bother to inspect could have reclosed these, but it didn't. That's what you would do if you wanted this to be a more than five brain room. But if you don't, then you do it this way. Cool! I like how I bother to go to the closest exit to de decrease my move count, but then I make this misstep and don't do anything about it. <laughs> Only a master of impatience shall pass, so I need to not be patient. Hi, Rochi. Why are you not moving? You're on a force arrow, that's why. So, um... feel like this is telling me... something. So those will become inaccessible. Uh, this is going to turn on when you do that. So... Okay, well it looks as though this is the required Mimic starting position because of the Roach. Then he needs to use that orb for me. I have no time pressure yet. Okay, well that's simple enough, right? I see no issues yet. I think I know what's gonna happen here. Yeah, I know exactly. Okay, so watch this. If I do that, I'm just one turn short. So here's what I can do. Uh, I can move the Mimic to my north, and because he goes after that, after I do, uh, his impatience will allow him to make a northward step there after the door opens. So that's how I get somebody up there before that happens. <laughs> that's pretty cool. I like it. I see why this got first place. This is very high quality. It's not like super dramatic or anything, you know, it's a, it's a just a just a real good quality five brain hold. Only a master of coordination shall pass. And also I like the 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 flavor of the <laughs> the theming of the scrolls. Uh okay, Roach. You got to step on stuff for me. Is there a reason I need to not kill you? Hold on. I think Oh, I see why I care about that. Oh, we gotta press the plates simultaneously. That's the issue, because this roach can't get out. That's the only way to kill the serpents. Keep this alive and keep it from stepping on this door, because then it would get out. That's why I want this north space. Doesn't seem like that needs to be stepped. That's unnecessary. And that would be an odd number, so I mustn't step here. Okay, step on all the others in pairs, like this. Ones like this are going to be real interesting for pairing. In fact, I think I want to do this. I would be in trouble if I didn't do it that way. I'm not certain, but I, th I think that's probably what I see. So now I could do uh, this. Yeah, that's fine. 
Then I can do these two vertically and those two horizontally and it'll be good. Cool. All right. Um, let's, let's do that from a different position. Cool. Cool. Uh, I would rather have this. Don't step there, but do step here. Okay. Thanks, Rochi. You did your job well. Ah, and that's what the last one is for. <laughs> to open this. Nice. 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 Eleventh place again. Is that last place? No, it's not. Okay. That was a name I didn't recognize. Only a master of displacement shall pass. Displacement. There's a staff. There's a dagger. Oh, fantastic. Fantastic. I get it. I get it. I see exactly what to do. I don't know what the dagger's for yet. Um, I'm not going to use it. What I'm going to do is this. Oh, that didn't work. What I'm going to do is get some more distance and then... Oh, that didn't work. Okay, so, so there's a little more to it than that. Uh, so I need you coming... F wait, what? So the move I want to do is to have the roach here and then make this step. That won't work. The roach won't be able to step there. What I need to do is to swap this evil eye for the roach without releasing the plate. So that's what the dagger's for. Got it. I don't use the stick for that. Well, I can use the stick to position the roach. That'll make it easier. Okay. Got a plan here. So, oh, careful. Let's put you right here. That's your home. I'm gonna switch to the dagger, pull you out, and then here's what I do. I stand here, I stab, and then I go here. Then Roach can toggle that, and I do this. Awesome! I don't believe I've ever seen a mechanism exactly like that, but that's super cool. That's an example of a thing the dagger can do. Wow, so to kill without occupying the space you kill in, wow. When I made the one hold that I've published so far, I um, I wanted to make a room about dagger usage, and I found mostly just things the dagger cannot do, and made the room about that more than like what it can do, but that demonstrates a special ability of it. Yeah, so killing without occupying the tile it kills in. Only a master of stealth shall pass. Okay. Wait. Really? <laughs> Thanks for the vision token. Oh, okay, now hang on. There's some... Um, there's some unraveling to do here. Not much. Okay, this feels like a an early journey, journey to rooted hold room. Oops. Um, oh, I have a problem. Uh, okay, so there's a twist. I think the joke is that I can. No, it's not. I can't move you there in time. Okay, so there's something to this. What's the idea? Was I supposed to bring an eye with me? I don't see how that could have helped. Now, hang on. Am I closer to this edge from that position? No, no, that's still no good. Okay, so I have what looks like an impassable barrier here. You're the key. Got it. I understand. Okay, so here's what I do. All right. So I too quickly thought this was just an easy room. Yeah, okay, so once again, this really feels like an early, early journey to Rooted Hold room. Because it's like, take this one obvious action, then toward the end of the room, there's a little twist to it. There's a slightly less obvious version of the action you have to take. Uh-huh. 
Yeah, that was the experience for a lot of Journey to Rooted Hold. Um, just that exact pattern in a room. Okay, cool. Then it was just evil eyes, so like old, old monsters and everything. All right. Master of Perching shall pass. Hmm. Oh, I get it. Oh. <laughs> okay. So, one mimic has to perch here, the other mimic has to perch here. Okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. I saw you guys moving, don't worry about it. I'll handle you next. Okay, so, um, gonna leave this one trapdoor here. There's no reason to leave the rest. I just need the one. Yeah, okay. Uh, so assuming I have enough leverage, which I'm pretty sure I do, um, I'm gonna need like a lot in this direction. You, you, you need to be, you, you need to be, you need to be. There we go. All right, get yourselves split something like this. Almost, actually, uh, very almost. But you both need to be norther. Is that north enough? Mm, slightly wrong for you. There we go. That's wrong. This doesn't work. So what I need to... No, wait, what? Okay, this is fine, but I need to have Bethro positioned differently from how I thought he was going to be. So Bethro is in fact going to be here. Here. All right, so you go south two and west one. Okay, and we're perched. So now mimics need to. Okay, so I need to be sure I kill like those guys. There we go. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's so good. All right, and that's the whole level. Nice. Plus the one bonus level. What am I a master of if I do this? General technique. All the things. Five brains, four brains, three brains, two brains, one brain. And zero brains means it's solved. <laughs> Ten fun. <laughs> yeah, that's the brain rating and fun rating. So it went from zero fun to ten fun when I turned that on. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> you have to know what the Caravel Net interface looks like to get this joke, but it's, it's a very good joke if you do. <laughs> If you don't know, you'll have to take my word for it. Awesome! And hold! Hold totals. Good. Six secrets found. I think that's all of them, unless I missed one there in that last level. I didn't check that one. Ten hours, 46 minutes. 100%. Awesome! Alright, so that's take five. Check out Careful Forums for more information about the take five contest. There is a link in the description in case you're curious to the forum thread for it. All right, cool. So this was uh, this was what I was playing as a, uh, a refreshment after um, what was it called? Tarstuff Horticulture Facility, and it was a pretty good one. Um, do I have any final thoughts? I don't really even need to look at this li list. I can just look at the map. Map is super cool. Good job in the art here, insoluble. Um, I think I pretty much gave my thoughts on each entry as I played it, so I probably don't really need to go back and do a, um, a recap. I agree with 1, 2, and 3. Uh, those were all super excellent. I agree with 5 brains for, for all of them. Even if most of the brains here felt 4-ish to me, the architect said uh, he was worried about um, landing too high in the difficulty. Uh, so maybe, I don't know. I feel like that may be overshot just a little bit in the other direction, the being too easy, except for a few of the rooms. The challenges were not part of the initial entry, um, so those were added later. I was pleasantly surprised with how, how nice this was for a troll entry that's trying to be super hard in a <laughs> supposed to not be too hard um, contest. This was actually mostly pretty pleasant, except for that one room I didn't bother getting done. I'm still not going to bother getting it done, by the way. <laughs> Uh, yeah, anyway, cool. So, hold done. Good. That's another one complete. I'll see you next time for another hold.